Dagestan, Russian, Dagestan officially the Republic of Dagestan Russian, Respublika Dagestan is a federal subject a republic of Russia, located in the North Caucasus region. Its capital and largest city is Makakala, centrally located on the Caspian Sea coast. With a population of 2,910,249, Dagestan is very ethnically diverse and Russia's most heterogeneous republic, with the largest ethnicity constituting less than 30% of the population. Largest among the ethnicities are the Avar, Dargan, Kumik, Lesgian, Lax, Azerbaijani, Tabasaran, and Chechen. Ethnic Russians comprise about 3.6% of Dagestan's total population. Russian is the primary official language and the lingua franca among the ethnicities. Dagestan has been a scene of Islamic insurgency, occasional outbreaks of separatism, and ethnic tension since the 1990s. According to the International Crisis Group, the militant Islamist organization Shariat Jamaat is responsible for much of the violence. Much of the tension is rooted in an internal Islamic conflict between traditional Sufi groups advocating secular government and more recently introduced Salafist teachers preaching the implementation of a certain form of sharia in Dagestan. Its government was dissolved in a major corruption investigation on 5 February 2018, and the region has since been under the direct control of the Russian government. Toponymy. The word Dagestan is of Turkish and Persian origin. The Turkish word dag means mountain, and the Persian suffix stan means land. Some areas of Dagestan were known as Albania, Lesgistan, Averia, and Tarkov at various times. Between 1860 and 1920, Dagestan was referred to as Dagestan Oblast, corresponding to the southeastern part of the present day republic. The current borders were created with the establishment of the Dagestan Autonomous Soviet Socialist Republic in 1921, with the incorporation of the eastern part of Terek Oblast, which is not mountainous but includes the Terek littoral at the southern end of the Caspian Depression. Topic. Names for Dagestan Topic. Official languages Russian Respublika Dagestan Respublika Dagestan Avar Dagestanalul Zumgoriat Dagestanalul Jumhuriat Dargan Dagestan's Respublika Dagestan's Respublika Kumik Dagestan Zumgoriat Dagestan Kumhuriat Lesgian Respublika Dagestan Respublika Dagestan Lok Dagestanal Respublika Dagestanal Respublika Tabasaran Dagestan Respublika Dagestan Respublika Rudal Respublika Dagestan, Respublika Dagestan. Agil Respublika Dagestan, Respublika Dagestan. Sahor Respublika Dagestan, Respublika Dagestan. Nogai Dagestan Respublika C, Dagestan Respublika C. Chechen Dahastan Pachak, Dagestan Paxil. Azerbaijani Dagestan Respublika C, Dagestan Respublika C. Topic Non-official languages Turkish, Dagestan Kumhuriyeti Arabic Jamrit Dagestan Jumhuriyet Dagestan Persian Jamri Dagestan Jumhuriye Dagestan Georgian Dagestanis Respublika Dachustanis Respublika Ingush Dag I Aste Dagaste Kulmik Dagzantak Dagzantanya Geography The Republic is situated in the North Caucasus Mountains. It is the southernmost part of Russia and is bordered on its eastern side by the Caspian Sea. Area, 50,300 square kilometers 19,400 square miles Borders Internal, Kalmykia N, Chechnya W, and Stavropol Krai N, W, International, Azerbaijan, Balakan District, Kachmaz District, Oghuz District, Kabala District, Qakh District, Kusur District, Shaki District and Zakatala District S, Georgia, Kakheti SW Water, Caspian Sea e. Highest point, Mount Bazarduzu, Bazarduziu, 4446 meters, 14587 feet Maximum north-south distance, 400 kilometers, 250 miles. Maximum east-west distance, 200 kilometers, 120 miles. 
Topic: Rivers. There are over 1,800 rivers in the Republic. Major rivers include Sulak River, Samar River, Tarek River, Vladis River, Sea Center River. Topic: Lakes. Dagestan has about 405 kilometers (252 miles) of coastline on the Caspian Sea. Topic: Mountains. Most of the republic is mountainous, with the Greater Caucasus Mountains covering the south. The highest point is the Bazarduzu – Bazarduziu Peak at 4,470 meters (14,670 feet) on the border with Azerbaijan. The southernmost point of Russia is located about 7 km southwest of the peak. Other important mountains are Diklamta meters feet, Gora Adala Shukjelmetsar meters feet, and Gora Jatidag meters feet. Topic: Natural Resources. Dagestan is rich in oil, natural gas, coal, and many other minerals. Topic. Climate The climate is hot and dry in the summer but the winters are harsh in the mountain areas. Average January temperature, plus 2 degrees Celsius 36 degrees Fahrenheit. Average July temperature, plus 26 degrees Celsius 79 degrees Fahrenheit. Average annual precipitation 250 mm 10 in northern plains to 800 mm 31 in in the mountains. Topic: <inaudible> Administrative divisions. Dagestan is administratively divided into 41 districts, rayons and 10 cities towns. The districts are further subdivided into 19 urban type settlements and 363 rural okrugs and stanitsa okrugs. Topic: History. Topic: Early 1st millennium. In the first few centuries AD, Caucasian Albania corresponding to modern Azerbaijan and southern Dagestan became a vassal and eventually subordinate to the Parthian Empire. With the advent of the Sasanian Empire, it became a satrapy province within the vast domains of the empire. In later antiquity, it was a few times fought over by the Roman Empire and the Sassanid Persians as the former sought to contest the latter's rule over the region, without success. Over the centuries, to a relatively large extent, the peoples within the Dagestan territory converted to Christianity alongside Zoroastrianism. In the 5th century, the Sassanids gained the upper hand, and by the 6th century constructed a strong citadel at Durbant, known henceforward as the Caspian Gates, while the northern part of Dagestan was overrun by the Huns, followed by the Caucasian Avars. During the Sasanian era, southern Dagestan became a bastion of Iranian culture and civilization, with its center at Durbant, and a policy of Persianization can be traced over many centuries. <laughs> Islamic influence In 664, the Persians were succeeded in Durbant by the Arabs, who in the 8th century repeatedly clashed with the Khazars. Although the local population rose against the Arabs of Durban in 905 and 913, Islam was eventually adopted in urban centers, such as Samander and Kabachi from where it steadily penetrated into the highlands. By the 15th century, Albanian Christianity had died away, leaving a 10th-century church at Tatuna as the sole monument to its existence. Topic. Alternating Persian and Russian rule As Mongolian authority gradually eroded, new centers of power emerged in Kaitagi and Tarki. In the early 16th century, the Persians under the Safavids reconsolidated their rule over the region, which would, intermittently, last till the early 19th century. In the 16th and 17th centuries, legal traditions were codified and mountainous communities obtained a considerable degree of autonomy. 
The Russians intensified their hold in the region for the first time in the 18th century, when Peter the Great annexed maritime Dagestan from Safavid Persia in the course of the Russo-Persian War The territories were however returned to Persia in 1735 per the Treaty of Ganja. Between 1730 and the early course of the 1740s, following his brother's murder in Dagestan, the new Iranian ruler and military genius Nader Shah led a lengthy campaign in swaths of Dagestan in order to fully conquer the region, which was met with considerable success, although he was eventually inflicted several decisive defeats by various of the ethnic groups of Dagestan, forcing him to retreat with his army. From 1747 onwards, the Iranian-ruled part of Dagestan was administered through the Durbant Khanate, with its center at Durbant. The Persian expedition of 1796 resulted in the Russian capture of Durbant in 1796. However, the Russians were again forced to retreat from the entire Caucasus following internal governmental problems, allowing Iran to capture the territory again. Topic. Russian rule consolidated. In 1806 the Khanate voluntarily submitted to Russian authority, but it was not until the aftermath of the Russo-Persian War 1804 that Russian power over Dagestan was confirmed, and that Qajar Iran officially ceded the territory to Russia. In 1813, following Russia's victory in the war, Iran was forced to cede southern Dagestan with its principal city of Durbant, alongside other vast territories in the Caucasus to Russia, conforming with the Treaty of Gulistan. The 1828 Treaty of Turkmenche indefinitely consolidated Russian control over Dagestan and removed Iran from the military equation. Topic: <inaudible> Risings against Imperial Russia. The Russian administration, however, disappointed and embittered the Highlanders. The institution of heavy taxation, coupled with the expropriation of estates and the construction of fortresses including Makakala, electrified highlanders into rising under the aegis of the Muslim imamate of Dagestan, led by Ghazi Muhammad Gamzat Bek and Shamil This Caucasian war raged until 1864. Dagestan and Chechnya profited from the Russo-Turkish War 1877 to rise together against Imperial Russia for the last time Chechnya rose again at various times throughout the late 19th and 20th centuries. <inaudible> <inaudible> Soviet era On 21 December 1917, Ingushetia, Chechnya, and Dagestan declared independence from Russia and formed a single state called the United Mountain Dwellers of the North Caucasus, also known as the Mountainous Republic of the Northern Caucasus which was recognized by major world powers. The capital of the new state was moved to Tamir Khan Shura. The first prime minister of the state was Tapa Chermayev, a prominent Chechen statesman. The second prime minister was an Ingush statesman Vasin Guri Jubajiev, who in 1917 also became the author of the Constitution of the Land, and in 1920 was re-elected for a third term. After the Bolshevik Revolution, Ottoman armies occupied Azerbaijan and Dagestan and the region became part of the short-lived mountainous republic of the Northern Caucasus. After more than three years of fighting the white movement and local nationalists, the Bolsheviks achieved victory and the Dagestan Autonomous Soviet Socialist Republic was proclaimed on January 20, 1921. Nevertheless, Stalin's industrialization largely bypassed Dagestan and the economy stagnated, making the republic the poorest region in Russia. Post-Soviet era In 1999, an Islamist group from Chechnya, led by Shamil Basayev and Ibn al-Khattab, launched a military invasion of Dagestan, with the aim of creating an independent Islamic state of Dagestan. The invaders were driven back by the Russian military. As a retaliation, Russian forces subsequently reinvaded Chechnya later that year. Violence in the republic exploded from the beginning of 2010 to the end of 2012. This upsurge led many people to claim that Dagestan was about to enter into a situation of sectarian civil war. Dagestan became the epicenter of violence in the North Caucasus with Makakala, Kaspisk, Durbant, Kasavyurt, Kizilyar, Sergakala, Untsukal, and Sumata all becoming hotbeds of militant activities. 
Topic: Politics. The Parliament of Dagestan is the People's Assembly, consisting of 72 deputies elected for a four-year term. The People's Assembly is the highest executive and legislative body of the Republic. The Constitution of Dagestan was adopted on 10 July 2003. According to it, the highest executive authority lies with the State Council, comprising representatives of 14 ethnicities. The members of the State Council are appointed by the Constitutional Assembly of Dagestan for a term of four years. The State Council appoints the members of the government. The ethnicities represented in the State Council are Avars, Dargans, Kumiks, Lesgans, Laks, Azerbaijanis, Tabasarans, Russians, Chechens, Nogay, Aguls, Rudals, Sahors, and Tats. Formerly, the chairman of the State Council was the highest executive post in the Republic, held by Magomedali Magomedovich Magomedov until 2006. On 20 February 2006, the People's Assembly passed a resolution terminating this post and disbanding the State Council. Russian President, Vladimir Putin offered the People's Assembly the candidature of Muku Aliyev for the newly established post of the President of the Republic of Dagestan. The nomination was accepted by the People's Assembly, and Muku Aliyev became the first President of the Republic. On 20 February 2010 Aliyev was replaced by Magomed Salam Magomedov. The current head of the republic is Ramazan Abdulatipov acting until 2013, following the resignation of Magomedov. Demographics Because its mountainous terrain impedes travel and communication, Dagestan is unusually ethnically diverse, and still largely tribal. It is Russia's most heterogeneous republic. Dagestan's population is rapidly growing. Population: 2,910,249, 2010 census; 2,576,531, 2002 census; 1,802,579, 1989 census. Topic: Settlements. Topic: Vital statistics. Source, Russian Federal State Statistics Service Topic. Ethnic groups The people of Dagestan include a large variety of ethnicities. According to the 2010 census, Northeast Caucasians including Avars, Dargans, Lesgans, Laks, Tabasarans, and Chechens make up almost 75% of the population of Dagestan. Turkic peoples, Kumiks, Azerbaijanis, and Nogay make up 21%, and Russians 3.6%. Other ethnicities e tats, each account for less than 0.4% of the total population. It should be noted that such groups as the Botlik, the Andi, the Akvaks, the Tsez and about 10 other groups were reclassified as Avars between the 1926 and 1939 censuses. The indigenous ethnicities of Dagestan are in bold. There are also 40 or so tiny groups such as the Hinnik, numbering 439, or the Akvaks, who are members of a complex family of indigenous Caucasians. Notable are also the Hunzab or Kunzal people who live in only four towns in the interior. Languages <inaudible> 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 More than 30 local languages are commonly spoken, most belonging to the Northeast Caucasian language family. Russian became the principal lingua franca in Dagestan during the 20th century. Over 20 of Russia's 131 endangered languages, as identified by UNESCO, can be found in Dagestan. Most of these endangered languages have Dagestani speakers in the mountainous region on the Dagestan Georgia border. Prior to Soviet rule, the literary lingua franca status to some extent belonged to classical Arabic. The northern Avar dialect of Kunzik has also served as a lingua franca in mountainous Dagestan where Avar-related peoples lived. And throughout centuries the Kumik language had been the lingua franca for the bigger part of the northern Caucasus, from Dagestan to Kabarda, until the 1930s. Kumik also had been an official language for communication of Russian imperial administration with the local peoples. The first Russian grammar written for Dagestani languages was that for locally international Kumik. 
Author Timofey Makarov wrote, From the people speaking Tatar language I liked the most Kumiks, as for their language's distinction and precision, so for their closeness to the European civilization, but most importantly, I take an account that they live on the left flank of the Caucasian front, where we're conducting military actions, and where all the peoples, apart from their own language, speak also Kumik. Religion According to a 2012 survey which interviewed 56,900 people 83% of the population of Dagestan adheres to Islam, 2.4% to the Russian Orthodox Church, 2% to Caucasian folk religion and other native faiths, 1% are non-denominational Christians. In addition, 9% of the population declares to be "...spiritual but not religious." 2% is atheist and 0.6% follows other religions or did not answer the question. Dagestanis are largely Sunni Muslims, of the Shafi rites, that has been in place for centuries. On the Caspian coast, particularly in and around the port city of Durban, the population, primarily made up of Azerbaijanis, is Shia. There is also a Salafi population, which is often a target of official repression. A relatively large number of native Tati speaking Jews, the Mountain Jews were also present in this same coastal areas. However, since 1991 and the collapse of the Soviet Union, they have migrated to Israel and the United States. These were an extension of much larger Azerbaijani Jewish community across the border in the Azerbaijani districts of Kuba and Shamaki. The appearance of Sufi mysticism in Dagestan dates back to the 14th century. The two Sufi tariqas that spread in the North Caucasus were the Naqshbandiya and the Qadiriya. The mystic Tariqas preached tolerance and coexistence between the diverse people in the region. The communist total intolerance for any religion after the communist revolution of 1917 also suppressed the Sufi movements. Sheikh Said Afandi al Cherkawi was a prominent scholar, spiritual leader, and murshid of Naqshbandi and Shadhili Tariqas in Dagestan until his death. The number of Christians among the non Slavic indigenous population is very low, with estimates between 2000 and 2500. Most of these are Pentecostal Christians from the Lok ethnicity. The largest congregation is Osana Evangelical Christian Church Pentecostal in Makakala, with more than 1,000 members. Economy The major industries in Dagestan include oil production, engineering, chemicals, machine building, textile manufacturing, food processing, and the timber. Oil deposits are located in the narrow coastal region. The Dagestani oil is of high quality and is delivered to other regions. Dagestan's natural gas production goes mostly to satisfy local needs. Agriculture is varied and includes grain farming, viticulture and wine making, sheep farming, and dairying. The engineering and metalworking industries own 20% of the republic's industrial production assets and employ 25% of all industrial workers. Dagestan's hydroelectric power industry is developing rapidly. There are five power plants on the Sulak River providing hydroelectric power. It has been estimated that Dagestan's total potential hydroelectric power resources are 4.4 billion kilowatts. Dagestan has a well-developed transportation system. Railways connect the capital Makakala to Moscow, Astrakhan, and the Azerbaijani capital, Baku. The Moscow-Baku highway also passes through Dagestan, and there are air links with major cities. Conditions for economic development are favorable in Dagestan, but, as of 2006 the republic's low starting level for a successful transition to market relations, in addition to rampant corruption, has made the region highly dependent on its underground economy and the subsidies coming from the central Russian government. Corruption in Dagestan is more severe than in other regions of the former Soviet Union and is coupled with a flourishing black market and clan based economic system. In 2011, Rostelecom started implementation of WDM based equipment on the backbone network for data transmission in the Republic of Dagestan. Due to WDM introduction, the fiber optic communication line's bandwidth increased to 2.5 gigabits per second. Rostelecom invested about 48 million rubles in the project. Dagestani conflict Since 2000, Dagestan has been the venue of a low-level guerrilla war, bleeding over from Chechnya. The fighting has claimed the lives of hundreds of federal servicemen and officials—mostly members of local police forces— 
as well as many Dagestani national rebels and civilians. More recently, among other incidents, on 15 May 2008, two MVD officers were killed and one police officer heavily wounded during an ambush on their vehicle in Gubdan. On 8 September 2008, Abdul Majid and several rebels were killed in an ambush by Russian special forces. On 21 October 2008, rebels ambushed a Russian military truck, killing five soldiers and wounding nine others. On 6 January 2010, a suicide bomber attempted to blow up a police station in Makakala, killing six officers and wounding 14 others. On 31 March 2010, 12 people were killed and 18 wounded by two suicide bombings in the town of Kizilyar outside the offices of the local Interior Ministry and the FSB Security Agency. The second bomb went off 20 minutes after the first, as a crowd had gathered. In the early hours of the next morning, two people died as a bomb went off in their car, apparently prematurely, near the village of Todorbiakala. On 15 July 2010, Pastor Artur Sulamanov, a Muslim convert to Christianity, was murdered by a gunman. The pastor was killed in his car as he was leaving the Hosanna House of Prayer in Makakala, according to a religious persecution watchdog group, Voice of the Martyrs, report. Pastor Sulaimanov's church is one of the largest Protestant churches in Dagestan. Christians in the Russian Republic of Dagestan, which borders Chechnya, face harassment and intimidation from various groups. Pastor Sulaimanov's life had been threatened on several previous occasions. On 23 September 2011, Magomed Murtazaliev, a high-level law enforcement official, was shot and killed by gunmen. On 28 September 2011, seven civilians and a police officer were killed by a car bomb in the village of Hajalmaki. On 4 May 2012, 12 people were killed in two separate explosions on the outskirts of Makakala. On 28 August 2012, Sheikh Said Afandi, an influential 75-year-old Sufi cleric, was killed along with six others in a suicide bombing. Afandi, a Sufi Muslim, opposed violent jihad in Dagestan. Topic. Notable people Adam Amiralayev, politician. Abdulkakim Ismailov, 1916-2010, World War II soldier. Abdul Rashid Sudalive, freestyle wrestler, a three-time world champion, 2014, 2015, 2018, European champion, 2014, European Games champion, 2015, two-time cadet world champion, 2012, 2013, Golden Grand Prix champion, Olympic gold medalist, 2016. Abdusalam Gadisov, freestyle wrestling world champion. Adam Satyev, the 12th of December 1977, Kasavyrt, Dagestan ASSR, Russia's freestyle wrestler, a Chechen, Russian master of sports of international class, honored master of sports of Russia, 2000, three-time champion of Russia, 1999, 2000, 2002, three-time champion Europe, 1999, 2000, 2006, two-time world champion, 1999, 2002, Olympic champion, 2000. Ali Aliyev wrestler, Avar Dagestani born Soviet Union freestyle wrestler. He won five world titles. Ali Bagatinov, UFC fighter in the flyweight division. Combat Sambo world champion. Bekhan Goizhereyev, wrestler who won the gold medal at the 2013 World Wrestling Championships. Bavasar Sadiev B, the 11th of March 1975 in Kasavyrt, Dagestan ASSR, Russia's freestyle wrestler, three-time Olympic champion, six-time world champion, six-time European champion, five-time Russian champion, seven-time winner of the tournament Krasnoyarsk Ivan Yargin winner Goodwill Games well. Honored Master of Sports of Russia 1995. Jubbar Askarov, he is the World Muay Thai Council's Muay Thai welterweight European champion and K1 Max Scandinavia 2008 tournament finalist. DZ Hamal Oderzultanov won the gold medal in men's freestyle 55 kg at the 2012 London Olympics. Eduard Puderbrot, 1940-1993, Dagestan artist and member of the USSR Union of Artists. Gasret Aliyev, hero of Soviet Union. Gaydarbek Gaydarbekov, boxer of Avar Heritage, who has won two Olympic medals in middleweight including the gold medal at the 2004 Games. Hizgil Avshalimov 1913-2001, Soviet novelist, poet, playwright. 
wrote in Mountain Jews and Russian languages. Israel Svagenbaum b. 1961, Russian American artist. Khabib Nurmagomedov, UFC fighter in the lightweight division and the current undisputed lightweight champion. Kajimarid Magomedov, Olympic gold medalist and two time world wrestling champion. Karamagomed Karamagomedov, b. 1978, freestyle wrestler who competed for Russia in the 2000 Summer Olympics and won a world title in 1997. Magomed Ibrahim Halilovich Ibrahimov he competed in the freestyle 85 kg competition at the 2000 Summer Olympics and won the bronze medal. Mansur Isayev, in 2012, he won the gold medal in judo at the 2012 Summer Olympics. Makach Mortazaliev, Russian Olympic wrestler who won the bronze medal for Russia at the 2004 Summer Olympics in Athens. Magomed Abdusalamov, is a Russian former heavyweight professional boxer who competed from 2008 to 2013. Magomedrashil Gazimagomedov, he won gold medal at the 2015 World Wrestling Championships at men's freestyle 70 kg. Magomedhan Aratsalov, former wrestler who competed in the 1980 Summer Olympics. Magomed Kurbanaliyev, Russian freestyle wrestler. World Freestyle Wrestling Champion 2016 in 70 kg. Magomed Magomedov, the professional WMC and IMF clarification needed light heavyweight world Muay Thai champion. Magomedrashil Kazbulayev, Frodo Kazbulayev, mixed martial artist of Avar heritage at one time fought in the featherweight division for the Bellator Fighting Championships. Mavlet Batirov, freestyle wrestler, world and two-time Olympic champion, who competed in the men's freestyle 55 kg category at the 2004 Summer Olympics and won the gold medal. Murad Umakhanov – Umakhanov competed at the 2000 Summer Olympics in Sydney where he received a gold medal in freestyle wrestling. Mushail Mushailov – a painter, a member of the USSR Union of Artists in Israel. Muslim Salikov – the only non-Chinese king of Sanda. Muslim Salikov is often acknowledged as one of the best Wushu Sanda competitors in history. Nurmagomed Shanavazov – Shanavazov won the light heavyweight silver medal at the 1988 Summer Olympics for the Soviet Union. Ramazan Sahin – Olympic gold medalist 2008, world champion 2007 in freestyle wrestling. Rashid Magomedov – UFC fighter in the lightweight division. Ruslan Magomedov – UFC fighter in the heavyweight division. Rasul Gamzadov (1923–2003), Avar poet, writer, political activist. Rustam Kabilov, UFC fighter in the lightweight division, combat sambo world champion. Sagid Mortazaliyev, two-time world champion, Olympic champion in freestyle wrestling. Saipula Absaidov, Olympic champion and world champion 1981 in freestyle wrestling. Sajid Sajidov, Russian Olympic wrestler who represented Russia at the world level from 2003 to 2006. He won the bronze medal at the 2004 Athens Olympics. Shamil Zavurov, combat sambo world champion three time. Shervani Muradov, wrestler, who has won a gold medal at the 2008 Summer Olympics and European champion 2007. Sergei Izgiyev 1922 to 1972 Mountain Jew Soviet poet playwright and translator Suleiman Karimov businessman investor philanthropist and politician featured on Forbes list as one of the richest people in Russia founded the Suleiman Karimov foundation as a vehicle for his charitable projects Sultan Abragamov professional boxer held the WBO heavyweight title from 2007 to 2008 as an amateur he won silver medals at the 2000 Olympics and 2000 European Championships, and bronze at the 2001 World Championships, all in the heavyweight division. Tagir Kabulayev, in the 2012 Summer Olympics, Kabulayev won a gold medal. Tamara Musakanova a sculptor and ceramist, a member of the USSR Union of Artists in Israel. Tanko Israeliv (1917–1981), ballet dancer, choreographer, people's artist of the USSR (1978). Vazif Malinov (1940–2015), Soviet dissident and political prisoner, political activist. 
Yagutil Mishiev B. 1927, honored teacher of the Republic of Dagestan and the Russian Federation, publicist, author of books about the history of Durban. Zabit Magomedsharipov, B. 1991, UFC fighter fighting in the featherweight division. Fatimat Madilovna Kicheva, B. Dagestan and Russian writer, national poet of Dagestan Republic, Ashug, publicist and journalist. Fatimat has made a major contribution to the development of Dagestan and Russian culture. See also Former countries in Europe after 1815, Insurgency in the North Caucasus List of clashes in the North Caucasus Music of Dagestan Notes References V. M. Solnchev I. Dr. Ed. 2000. Pismani Azika Mira Rasijska Federatia. Sociolingvistiska Enzyklopedia. In Russian. Moskva Rasijska Akademia Nauk. Institute Azikaznania. Proect 9904-16158, CS1 maint, multiple names, editors list, link. 10 Iula 2003 G. Constitutia Respubliki Dagestan v Red. Zakona 4507 October 2008 G, July 10, 2003 Constitution of the Republic of Dagestan, as amended by the Law No. 45 of October 7, 2008. <laughs> Further reading Catholic Haidic in the Holy Roman Empire Rus. Kaziev, Shapi. Imam Shamil. Moladaya Gavardia. Publishers. Moscow, 2001, 2003, 2006, 2010 Kaziev, Shapi. Akolgo. Caucasian War in the Nineteenth Century. The Historical Novel. Epic, Publishing House, Makakala, 2008. ISBN 978-5-98390-047-9 Kaziev, Shapi. Caucasian Highlanders. Everyday Life of the Caucasian Highlanders. 19th Century in the co-authorship with I. Karpayev. Moladaya Gavardi. Publishers. Moscow, 2003. ISBN 5-235-02585-7. Kaziev, Shapi. Crash of Tyrant. Nader Shah, Kradran. The historical novel about Nader Shah. Epic, Publishing House, Makakala, 2009. ISBN 978-5-98390-066-0. Topic. External links Official governmental website of Dagestan in Russian Egbert Wesselink 1998. Dagestan, Dagestan, Comprehensive Report. Caspian.net. Archived from the original on October 5, 2001. Retrieved January 15, 2012. Dagestan in Iranica Encyclopedia History of Islam in Russia the North Caucasus. Russian Analytical Digest No. 22, the 5th of June 2007. BBC Country Report on Dagestan. University of Texas Maps of the Dagestan Region. Radio Free Europe discusses religious tension in Dagestan. ISN case study: The North Caucasus on the Brink, August 2006. Articles on Dagestan, reports from research, photos. Dagestan in pictures in Russian Dagestan's Kaitag embroideries and Henri Matisse Dagestan Republic news portal in Russian